I am so glad I caught that now. Um, my microphone was unplugged. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome or welcome back. It has been a hot minute since the last Daredevil video and I'm sorry about that. The reactions were supposed to be weekly and then... I don't know what happened. <laughs> but don't worry, I didn't forget. Here we are, Daredevil Season 3, Episode 2. In the first episode, it's been a few months since I filmed so I gotta go back in my mind. Um, it was the aftermath of what happened in The Defenders. Matt was like taken in and he started training again to like regain his senses. Karen and Foggy think that Matt's dead. There's the FBI guy. What's his name? I'm gonna look it up without looking it up. Ready? Here's how I do that. Ray Nadine. I went on my last reaction and went to the tags and looked at the characters. All right. So. At first, when I was watching the episode, I, for some reason, was like, this is Bullseye. But, like, I should know better because, like, I know Bullseye's name. Well, I did. Um, isn't it, like, Point Dexter or, like, fuck. Um, I'm just gonna. Like, I, I knew his name before, so, like, this isn't a spoiler. Benjamin Point Dexter. Thank you. Point? Not Point Dexter. All right, Benjamin Point Dexter. I don't know when he shows up. Sometime. Maybe not this early though. And then we also saw Fisk last episode, and think he's willing to cut a deal, uh, make a deal, because in the description of this episode titled "Please," uh, the description is Matt suffers a crisis of faith and Fisk makes a deal. I feel like Matt suffered the crisis of faith last episode also, so. Just continuing that, I don't really know what else to say besides that, you know, you should subscribe and turn on the bell so you get notified whenever I post a new video. I have some good content coming this month, and then next year, I have so much planned. Also, there's my film channel, Yasmina Zinedine. I card up there, <laughs> yeah. Uh, where I'm working on my series, Trial and Error, episode 3 is coming out soon. I still have a lot of editing to do for that, so yeah, soon. All right, without further ado, let's watch Daredevil Season 3, Episode 2. The, the rhyme was formulating in my head as I was speaking. Hey, how's it going? What happened? Oh, the end of last episode, he, he was fighting again. Okay, I forgot about that. But then he left before the cops showed up. So I guess this is just after that. Oh, stop. I don't want to see crying Matt. Whoa. I can't wait for episode four. FBI! Oh. FBI! Made a deal. Hootie rat out. Thank you, Wilson Fisk. This mm. gift is going to keep on giving. Really? What are you going to do? Oh, you're spotting. How nice. Yeah. Woo! How is that crushing him? Just lay down. Yeah, then it's not hurting you. That was stupid. Oh, no. Is he not going to? He's resisting. Oh, yeah. If you're gonna stab someone, don't do it here. What kind of criminal are you? I don't think that's a comfortable place to sleep. Really, Maggie? Really? Well, he'd rather die as Daredevil than live as Matt Murdock. He says that at some point. Or did he already say it? So you can throw yourself pity and Gotta clean up the sink. His new show comes out soon. Treason, I think it's called. I'd find some other purpose. Uh, if you can be anything else, it was never really your calling. It happened to me too, Wilson. It was wonderful and terrifying. Yeah, she's I definitely. I struggle to know when you've seen his true face now. Seen? Really? We're gonna do <laughs> more seeing jokes. That's great. How many fights have you been in this week? How many guys complain? None. No one wants to admit they got their butt kicked by a blind kid. That's a perfectly understandable reaction to your situation. He's usually worse. 
subtle with that. You want to hear God, Matthew, you want to listen more carefully. Ooh, what's this? Oh, FBI. He's my kill. I get to eat first. There's a goddamn buffet in their conference room. You can't fill up on that. Why do I feel like there's a bug coming? Bugs? Shut the door. I'm sorry. No. No way. Easy, Ray. No. You tell DC that none of this could have happened without the unexpected connection between me and Wilson. Unexpected <laughs> connection? Karen. I believe it was last season. There was like a newspaper or something to do with Karen's brother. Are we going to dive more into it sometime this season? Oh my god, I really have the worst memory because I read a spoiler about like what happened, but I don't remember. But I guess that's a good thing. Like I wish this would happen for Supernatural since I know so many things about the show. You know, he and his uh, daughter were attacked outside a restaurant last night. Oh. There are reports of respiratory illnesses among residents of a particular city block. And which particular city block would that be? 44th and 11th. The building. There's still a lot of questions about that night that we don't have answers for. You think the answers are? Right? I don't know. What is it about Midland Circle? I mean, it's not just a story, is it? I thought you know, I'd be able to empathize with a young woman who's been caught up in the middle of a family oh. crisis. I said it was superficial. I find it quite profound. Don't start. Word is out. Everyone knows. Guards and inmates. It seems they know I'm cooperating with you. But you are going to continue to do, Mr. Fisk. I've suddenly become a target within these walls here. I can't do either of those things if I'm dead. If they wanted to kill you, they would have, Fisk. Come on. It's a message. It's a warning. <gasps> this outfit seems familiar. On TikTok, I have a collection for Daredevil stuff. It's usually um, stuff that I save so I can watch later. Like one of them is for episode six and stuff I haven't seen yet. So I know it's for season three. Asking for God's help or justice or vengeance sometimes. Vengeance. Uh, Pointed that way for justice because my dog justice is lying on my bed right now. <laughs> um, I was gonna say though, I believe this is the reason that this outfit looks so familiar is because he's say he's gonna say the line, "I'd rather die as the devil than live as Matt Murdock." I'm pretty sure he's wearing this outfit when he says it. That's why it's familiar. I have three days of school left this semester. My brain is on overdrive right now. I think we're gonna do like two or three final exams today. Yippee. That's what I did. That's what I was trying to do. I was trying to help people. But I am not what I was. Wherever your new reality is, you'll adjust. I was wrong. All I ever heard was people in pain. It's time for you to stop. Oh. <laughs> no, Father, my delusion was thinking God had anything to do with it. I'm Daredevil. Not even God could stop that. That was the line. The other one is a different part. That's not suspicious at all. Happy cleaners? That is a cover-up. You cannot tell me that this is a legit business. Free pickup and delivery. The giant smiley faces with the eyebrows? No, th this is a criminal activity van. Wait, is it actually hey, legit? I'm looking for a dry cleaner. We're not doing pickups right now, but we're on 14th Street. The address is on the side there. He's blind. Drugs. Kind of grassy, maybe? Yeah, sure, like that. Sure. I know. I've seen your picture in the Bulletin. It's your page. Not to be a bitch, but I don't want this in the papers. You think just because you don't want this to be in the papers that it, that it won't be? If I don't say anything, then I'll make up things that sound good to yeah. them. I learned that anything I say, anything at all, you people will turn it into whatever you want to do. You anything. people. Your father almost got killed, you know? But people said that I killed my brother. Kevin and Karen? <laughs> Sorry. Piece by piece and lie by lie. And um, I didn't really know uh, how to deal with it back then. Her eyes are such a piercing blue. But we were at dinner. You should have we a voice We were trying to patch things up. These two men grabbed my father. They tried to put him into this van. 
Is Daredevil stopped? We only got away because the other guy attacked him. Daredevil. He was shanked by another inmate a couple hours ago. Good. He's a cop killer. That wasn't proven in court. Yeah, whose fault was that? The guy's a piece of shit. You're right. Wilson Fisk is a piece of shit. Obviously. 107 civilian murders. And even after five task forces over seven years to turn on the million dollars, we got zero. With Fisk. With Fisk's intel, we beheaded the Albanian syndicate in one day. But New York is safer tonight because of Wilson Fisk. Ooh, that's a, that's a quote. Tell me you're not going for this. He will. Foggy! It's been so long. Nelson's needs. <laughs> Hi, Justice. Hi. She's just staring. I was gonna say, I forgot. Um. I forgot what the quote was in like season one with Foggy's mom saying something about a butcher shop. Oh my god! Foggy with kids, I love it. Uncle Foggy. Hi. Okay, yeah, but now Karen knows. Like, she's gonna suspect. Hi. Uh, she's gonna suspect Daredevil's back or like someone's back. She's probably gonna tell Foggy. Foggy's gonna be like. Karen, a building fell on him, okay? <laughs> He's dead. And then, I assume around that time, Bullseye's gonna come around. Christ, that joke is old. Yes. Aww. Listen, Franklin, there's some main things to talk to you about. Oh, no. Put those brains to work for your family. Not every uptown shithead that comes into your office. They're not all shitheads, Mom. Just most of them. I can smell the candy from here. Come here. Where'd you get that? Where'd you get that? Where'd you get that? Oh no. Ever since you could talk, you were around telling people that you own the store. <laughs> they play along with it too. This white convict. This white convict. He's gonna escape somehow. 100%. He got someone to shank him. That must be it. Or he was expecting it. Hey, you want service? You gotta get in line, man. You got a, a flyer? Got a royal? I was about uh, to say. I, I got seeing friends. Uh, thanks. I, I, oh, I his finger. Yeah, I found you. It makes my day. All right. <laughs> oh, let's go. I love the black suit. So what's going on that that guy is just missing a finger? What is that? Oh? Prisoner? Who are we holding hostage? Oh, it's so blurry. The sound. Ooh. Oh no. Matt, let yourself heal. My goodness. Sorry, I thought someone just vanished and then I realized that. No, Matt, don't do it. Not the zip ties. Call police. Yeah, I'd like to report an assault. I didn't see what happened, but there are a lot of guns here. You didn't see what There's happened. Some kind of I love the blind and seeing jokes in the show. Dude, Theo has Foggy's old hair. Why is there a soccer ball? Straighten that tie up, Foggy. Oh, so I was gonna film this video earlier, like a couple days ago, and then I pushed it off to yesterday, and then I didn't film it yesterday because I watched Aubrey Plaza's new movie, I'm Gonna Be a Criminal, which, the only reason I bring it up is because I found a connection as I was watching it. So. One of the main characters in this movie is played by Theo Rossi, and he plays Shades on Luke Cage. And I was like, wow, I should bring this up in the video. And then I totally forgot about it until just now. Matt and I talked a lot about what we do. Aww. Open our own firm, help people, get rich. Nice plan. I was the get rich part. He was the help people part. Both valid. Matt was a good guy. Yeah, how they talked about him in past tense. I wonder what Foggy's reaction is gonna be. Probably angry at first. Kind of relieved. Could go either way. Hey! Hey, Perfect timing! Now everyone can stop worrying about my career choices, stop worrying about me cheating on Marcy. I think that's a lie. Ooh. But his no, first suit. He's wearing a black mask. Look, you know how I know he's gone? Why he hasn't? Because if it was Matt, if he was really still alive, 
he would have reached out to us. I wish it was my best friend. But it's not. He's dead. Oh, I hope he's dead. You. I knew it was gonna be mad, but that's so funny. Look at him just. Okay, um. I get why Matt's not reaching out to Foggy and Karen, but he really should. Just so, you know, they're not grieving for a loss. Just like Father. He's Cause that's what I do. Thank God for you. Okay. He didn't help you. I didn't. You He's under escaping. The strict supervision of my team. He pretended to miss the source. Now I know he's definitely escaping because this is what happened last season. Searching and not finding. What about Vanessa? Well, so Vanessa. Vanessa. Yeah. Tell Vanessa. <laughs> Thank you. I didn't want to keep going with the impression. I thought I would explode with the sense of power. You thought you'd explode? What I took for true freedom was precisely the reverse. Imprisonment? Any truly determined man will find a way out. Stop. So you see, Agent Nadine. Is this a Darman video? So you see. I will do whatever I must. Oh no. He's out. He was talking about explosion. How he arranges all of this is beyond me. Driver is probably done. Ray's going to get hell for this. They're gonna be like, it was your idea. Wait. Wait, was it not him? Wait, was it really not him? Oh shit. Bullseye. What if it's Bullseye? Wow. Okay. I thought that whole monologue was like last time he planned this. But the way he's like yelling, I'm like, wow, okay. Wow, okay. Plot twist. Oh. Bullseye. The uh, shot. No, I I think it's bullseye because like that shot was perfect like to get his handcuffs. Plus, I don't know who else it'd be. Oh shit. Oh, it's the Albanians. I was so confused. I thought it was one person because I thought it was gonna be bullseye. This makes sense. But I I still feel like bullseye's gonna show up. I don't know why. Probably not. They're not gonna kill Fisk though. I know that. What do you even do? Oh, fuck, behind you. Bullseye! Oh, shit! Hey, convict, this way. This is the guy. Is he bullseye? Yeah. This has to be bullseye. Oh, fuck. I was- Wow. I'm not gonna say it. He's not gonna kill me with this. Dex. Knew it! Don't tell me Wilson Fisk is about to wheel in here. How are they here? Reporters. Ugh. Oh, that was a good episode. I really enjoyed that episode. You know, we had Matt struggling with, you know, who he is having this crisis of faith and getting back into his role of Daredevil, but still, you know, not being fully recovered. We saw Ray trying to take more, uh, more charge this episode. Cause you know, I'm the one who got the information out of Fisk. I should be the one in charge of this. Then we got to see Karen talk about her brother a little bit after doing more of her reporter stuff and then telling Foggy who we got to see with all this family which was nice uh, tell him that she suspects that Matt's alive but he has kind of accepted it and then we had the ending I was like Fisk set this up this is a parallel to last season or it wasn't last season it was season one um, <laughs> They all mixed together. Whenever I was talking about last season in reference to Fisk, I probably meant season one. You know, they they arrest him at his house, they take him, and then one of the cops or one of the guys was working for Fisk. So I thought it was gonna be like a a remake of that, but it wasn't his plan, which really caught me off guard. Then the Albanians tried to kill Fisk, 
but then Bullseye was there. I, I didn't realize that the guy was like, convict this way, was him until I, like, until we saw him in that scene. Um, so, like, I didn't really remember what he looked like from a couple of edits I'd seen in the past. I didn't know that Bullseye would be a part of the FBI. That's interesting. I'm really liking the season so far. We still have a long ways to go. Can't wait for episode four. I'm so excited about episode four just because I've heard really good things. Correct me if I'm wrong. Best rated episode of the series or another episode in season three? Oh, did you guys see the Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse trailer that came out yesterday? I'm very excited. Okay, it is the top rated episode as well as the season three finale. So excited to get to those. For next month, I'll probably do like every other week a Daredevil reaction. And then if I'm getting, like, good with scheduling in January, then in February I will do weekly Daredevil reactions. Then after Daredevil Season 3, I'm going back to The Gifted. I will. Um, I'll have to rewatch my old videos, though, so I can remember what's happening. But yes, definitely want to watch The Gifted. Then after I watch The Gifted, The Punisher will take place of The Gifted reactions. Lots of good content coming up, so stay tuned for that. And with that being said, thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure to subscribe and turn on the bell so you get notified whenever I post a new video. Also, subscribe to my film channel, Yasmina Zinedine. You can follow me on my social medias. I'll put here. Uh, but if I don't, they'll be in the description. Yeah, you know what? Why do, why do I have to put them up? Go to the description when you subscribe. Yeah. I don't know where that burst of confidence came from. <laughs> Can't believe I didn't show off the case once this episode. Alright, thanks for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Bye! What am I doing?